welcome back to my channel my name is Shayla and you are watching Shayla TV you are in store for another Louis Vuitton video where I'm talking all about my six key ring holder and my Victorine wallet and hot stamping too so if you guys enjoy this video then please go ahead and like and subscribe I will really appreciate it <laughs> okay y'all so this is my six key ring holder from Louis Vuitton. It's in the monogram canvas. I really, really enjoy this product. Um, trying to think where I want to get started with it. I'll just start with the outside. I love that it has the breast um, button. I've had it for a few months now. I want to say probably since January. And, um... I haven't really used it because I went to go take my two items to get hot stamped right before the quarantine started and then boom they was locked and tucked away for like 60 days like 60 70 days like about two months uh, I just got them like the last week in April so I've kind of had them um, in my possession now for about three weeks but I really, really enjoy it. And even though they were locked and tucked away at the store awaiting to get hot stamped, I think it was worth the wait. Um, I love everything about it. And this is, um, it's brown inside. I really don't do a lot of color, like fuchsia. It does come in fuchsia, I believe, or maybe it doesn't. I'll check that for you guys. But uh, I love the brown interior. So I did get my initials hot stamped and I've had no problems with the hot stamped. Those are my initials as CH. It um, comes with three, excuse me, it comes with six key holders, but I'm only utilizing three of them. I have my car key, I have my house key, and then I have the mailbox key. What I adore about this six key ring holder that I was like wasn't expecting just to be a feature I would use, but I use it way more often than normal. Is the little back pocket underneath here? So I'm gonna just slip out um, my cards and stuff. It has a little back flap that you could put cards and cash in. I haven't tried cash, but I do use it for cards. So I normally keep my three cards and that's my credit card my driver's license and my military id which is expired but um <laughs> anyway so i do uh use that and it's perfect i remember it came in handy when i had my purse and i was taking my dog to pet smart <clears throat> excuse me i was taking my dog to pet smart and I wanted to run in and pay. Well, instead of like trying to hold my poodle and my um my purse and my wallet and everything, I just took this in one hand. I had my puppy, my dog in another hand, and I was able to pay so easily. You just, you know, they tell you the total, you just slip this out, you take what you need, and then boom, you could just go. So I love this about this. You let it fly in the house. Oh. <laughs> I love that about this key holder and it's so easy to use everything is like brass and I love I am not mad at the amount of times I have counted and found Louis Vuitton on this item like it's around the brass um, button it's on the outside portion of the button it's right here Louis Vuitton Paris made in France Okay, so I got a French six key ring holder. I love um, seeing where the pieces are from. And I think this is my first French item, if I'm not mistaken. So I'm all for that. And then it also says Louis Vuitton at the top part of the brass holders. So this is something, this SLG, a small leather good, was something that blew me away. I know um, I saw some people have it. I saw it on YouTube. I was not really um, phased by it. I went ahead and purchased it, and now where would I be without it? And it's so much classier and cleaner to me than having like um, a big old key ring and having like a whole bunch of keys on it. I think this is just so much uh, it's, it's sleeker, and I appreciate that. 
it doesn't um, weigh my ignition down when I'm driving. It's uh, and it, you don't lose your keys. And like I don't have a lot of keys, but if I ever was to get more keys, you can you know use the remaining spaces I have. But you can also kind of double up on these if you needed to. Very sturdy. Like when I um this my key car key is bulky, but uh, even if I have it like this, and this is how you know I naturally drive. So this is just bomb. I love it. I enjoy it so much. My next item that I have for you guys is my Victor Freeman wallet. Okay, same canvas monogram, and then the it, the interior is uh, I think they call this cognac. It is also um hot stamped, and with my initials SCH. I opted not to get the dots. First of all, our um my SA he said that the dots. Are a little bit more challenging for them to do and plus i just thought like again i just thought it looked nicer without the dots breaking up the initials just run that sch all together it's cool so i love this wallet but i gotta tell you because i've been putting my um cards in this key holder I, i'm afraid that sometimes i don't really use my wallet as much as much as i should what I do love about this wallet, and I'm gonna put my um my cards in it real real quick. But what I do love about this wallet is you do not necessarily have to um open your wallet to use it when it comes to your cards. So here it's closed, and when I'm ready to pay, you could just reach from the top, and boom, you just reach from the top, and you pull out your card which is awesome. And then you could put it back in the same fashion. Same thing with my driver's license. Boom, I just pull it out, you know, show them, show the people, do what you need to do with it. And then you just kind of slip it back inside and it's real easy. Um, it does hold, it has three, six, six card spaces. You do behind um, this portion here have more space that you can use so I put some gift cards in there and stuff like that I also um I keep my Louis Vuitton card in case that my nothing bunk cakes a little tracker because you know if you if you purchase 10 bunk cakes that 11th one is free y'all so I do keep that to keep track of my bunk cakes so um I love it I do, I'm trying to carry cash, y'all. I never carry cash. But I do carry cash. I try to keep $10, $15 with me. Right now I have $25. I'm not a cash person. I did hear a tip where you, what you should do is um, this folds, right? And if you want your money to stay straight and not crinkle a lot, you need to put it towards the back way on this side of it. So when it folds, it's not folding your money. So like how I have it now, it's like way on this side, like it's hugging this side. And you see that space right here. So when I bend it to fold it, your money won't get, you know, crinkled. Only thing that I could say about this wallet is like, if you're not a change carrier, because I'm not a cash or loose change type of person, I would recommend you keep some coins up in here. It just keeps this looking so full. So, like, um, I don't have a lot of coins. I tried to find a whole bunch of silver coins. Y'all, I found an old piggy bank. And I said, girl, let me take some of these coins out. So, I did that. But I took all the coins out. And you see... Without the coins, like if you like this or like if you're trying to downsize your wallet, it's very flat. Very, very flat. And that's cool and everything. And it's very light too. But with the coins, I just feel like it gives it just a little bit of substance. It just gives it just a little, a little um, pop, a little weight. It just, I don't know. It just, I, I was going to say it looks more realistic, but I don't know. It, I like the way the coins help fill it out a little bit more so it's not like girl you just you carrying that wallet you ain't got nothing in it like no no ma'am i got something in this wallet so see it just makes it thicken up just a little bit so yeah 
So with the hot stamping, I love the hot stamping. When you go in to get your items hot stamped, they do allow you to pick the color, the font size of your letters, and also the placement. So I chose to put my hot stamping in the middle panel because like I, I'm holding it now, like I feel like if I did this, this covers it up, this portion covers it up. And I loved it like that. I got the middle size for the font and I decided to place it right in front of, or atop of the Louis Vuitton um, emblem or the, the signage. I believe this wallet was made in the USA, American made wallet. So I really enjoy the hot stamping, even on the six key ring holder. I was going to put it here on the middle panel for um, make it all uniformed. But as you can see, my keys cover it. So you would never really see it because like my car key stays there at all times. So I opted to put it on the left side. And I really enjoyed it. Enjoy it. Of course, I could have put it on this side. Um, it does say the Louis Vuitton Paris right there. I could have put it there, like right underneath it. But that's right where this crease is. So I thought after a while, it would fold, fade you know, crackle, get damaged, and I didn't want that. So I felt, felt like right here on this side was the safest spot. I enjoy it. I enjoy the personalization of my items. It just allows you to feel like, okay, we may all have the same items, but they're slightly different because, you know, your initials are in it. And you could pick different colors. I've seen them in blue, pink, orange, red, whatever. I chose gold to match the gold hardware um, with the button and with the inside that holds the keys. So when you do walk in and you do get your items hot stamped, you do have to wait. Well, depending on where you go, they told me that the normal turnaround time is two to three days. But of course, due to, you know, unforeseen circumstances, it turned into like two to three months. But um, it's all good. I love it. I enjoy it. I do think it's worth it. But if you're trying to like resell or you're thinking like, you know, you may not keep these items long, then of course I would not recommend hot stamping because after they do hot stamp it, it's yours forever. It's unreturnable unless you sell it to somebody who doesn't mind having your initials in it. Uh, I want to do a more in-depth in -depth review of SLGs. From Louis Vuitton. I think that they're a bomb. I think that they're amazing. I'll tell you right now, spoiler alert, this is a definite staple. And like I said, this wowed me, surprised me. I did not expect this little guy to like hold as much as it does in terms of keys and cards and cash. And you could use this as a mini wallet. So I've seen where some people don't purchase a wallet, they go straight here. I um, am very excited to do that for you guys if you guys are interested and talk about why I selected a compact wallet over a large full-size wallet. But I will keep the video short. I hope you enjoyed it, my mini review of the key holder and the wallet. I hope you find that these are worth it along with the hot stamp. And I will see you in my next video.